yellow Jeep Leaders jersey worn by John John Florence, the 2016 world champ. He's currently the leader on the Jeep leaderboard, but he's coming against this wild card, 20-year-old Yago Dora. He was our trials winner here in Sakurema, the top 10 out of those qualifying series ratings to join the world's elite in the championship tour in 2018. Yago is going to be first up to his feet and just an in and out, so nothing to be said about that with 28 minutes coming down. Yago Dora having a look at this little inside wave. Is he going to go? Here we go. They call him the skinny goat. Let's see what he's got coming down the line, building up some speed, smacks it off the lip there, looking for more. Right through, up in the air, and comes disconnected, incomplete. Florence scanning it, looking right. John John Florence up and riding, and ducks out as that wave just closes out. Surf out of your skin if you're going to beat him, and, and, and with that, mistakes are going to come. He looked a lot more comfortable up against Chloe Andino, but up here against John John Florence, you can see just going for broke on that last maneuver, getting disconnected from the board, but you kind of got to tone it down a bit and just get a couple of waves under your belt, build that confidence up. You can see that rail game we talk about and then pushing the issue on the last turn, unfortunately not making it. So, Yaga Dora. Have a look at this one. We'll get back to you in a jiffy. Thanks, Rich. And you're right. Here we go. All eyes on Yago Dora. Opens up with a nice carve. Tries to throw the air again, again with the same result, becomes disconnected. First heats we get in contests all around the world that are slow. Hang on, I'll just watch John here. All right, John John on a good looking left. Nice carve, keeps it on the wave face and pacing through a couple of turns here. Just nice paced surfing for John John Florence. Wants to get a number on the board and he's going to do so. Same as it's been, it's a, it's a little bit high, more high performance now because the backwash has gone a fair bit and, and you'll see some airs obviously, you know, these two guys out in the water, amazing aerial surfers. Um, and we'll see those combos and as, you know, we were talking all through the contest, we saw some of the combination of major manoeuvres yesterday in those critical sections, got that really high score. And, Obviously today the sections aren't as big, but it's still a comparison with each wave and what the guys are, and the girls later on are doing on them. All right, Richie, well, the score just came in for John John is at a 4.33 for that wave that we're watching on the replay. John John. Sleepy little start, winds up off the bottom, tracks it off the top, looks for a barrel, finds it every time, doesn't he? Kicks out. <laughs> And uh, that's all you need, really, in conditions like this. Yago Dora, here we go. Good looking wave left for Yago. Nice carve to start. Throws the air, reverse, and stomps the landing. Looks to the beach, and they like what they're seeing. To go, let's have a look at Yago's wave. And he's been trying this combo the entire heat so far. First turn, just hooks into it nicely, setting things up. And then the ability just to get up above the lip and spin that board around. Beautiful right there from Yago Dora. Nice rail game as well. Just hooking into that first turn. Double pump bottom turn. And then just got a lot of spring in his step, hasn't he? Lands backwards, spins that around. Great control from Yago. And on the other side, John, you can see just biding his time. I love this turn right here. Lightning fast maneuver. S hits the brakes, pulls in nice and tight. Not a deep barrel, so I can't see it going too high, but... And then Yago again, rapid fire. So this heat's starting to warm up. We're starting to see these guys show a little bit more interest, a little bit more energy. Game on. Waiting for scores. Last to John John was a 5.83. Here's another look at Dora. Yeah, this is, uh, this is the, the one we just saw the end of. Yago Dora, two-turn combo. So John with a 4.33 and a 5.83. We're still waiting for... That air reverse from Yaga and this one here, two-turn combo from Yaga Dora. Wow. Well, 8.33 up in the excellent range, and yep. he's hearing it right now from the beach announcer. Yep, 8.33. Well, you can see two eight fives, three eights. You drop behind the low, averaged out 8.33. Great surfer from Yago. Dora's going to stay busy now, looking to the right. Nice vertical approach on the first turn. Looks it through, 
And uh, their finishing move, and the crowd continues to grow, and they love this young, up-and-coming phenom. John John right behind him. Scratching. Warbly wave. Nice hook to start off. Looking for something big. Goes for the alley-oop. Lands on the roof and goes down. Wow. For uh, mixing it up with a bit of backhand surfing as well. You can see John first turn, just setting things up. I like the way he hits the brakes and now he starts to get those legs bent. Big alley hoop lands on the roof of the wave and goes down. So a little bit of a mistake there from John. And on the flip side of the coin, Yaga Dora with a nice tight backhand snap. Draws off the bottom and hooks it up nice and vertical again. So two-turn combo from Yaga Dora. Requirement for John John Florence, you can see now a near-perfect score. John John needs a 9.67. Come around the corner here. What's he got? He's got a big slash, building up some speed. Hucks a full row on the roof again. Incomplete again. And the plot continues <laughs> to thicken pots. That's what he's got to do, though. In fact, he's got to light it up. I like it. A bit more energy, just catch waves, f try and find the groove. You know, this kid's the best in the world. I, I, I have no doubt he's going to come back swinging. Beautiful air reverse, lands on the roof of the lip again, and just doesn't quite make that transition. So, you know, sometimes when you're in a little bit of a hurry, sometimes when you're trying to force the issue, things don't quite go the way you want them to. But look at that beautiful rotation. Lands a little bit too far up the board and goes down again. Five minutes remaining, Yaga Dora. Dora's for sure going to utilize priority. Takes the wave from John John. Clock's winding down. Does John have enough time? Yago surfs this through. Horn blows. And a statement to the world. Yago Dora, 20 years old from Florianopolis, oh. is on to oh. round the number four, beating world number one, John John Florence Potts. Well, I have to say, I didn't see that coming. Uh, you know, you watch the beginning of that heat. A couple of mistakes from the rookie, the wild card, but he just proved that he is one to watch. That is for sure.